What's up, people? This is your boy, Big Solo. This is what you call Rikers Island Stories, jailbreak by who? By me, Wah. Big Solo, K Solo. Whatever you want to call me, just don't call me for lunch. Not late. <laughs> anyway, I'm taking a walk today. Um, I know, I know, it's not by choice. Not by choice. I had to go see my doc today. You know, I got to go see Dr. Feel Good. You know what I'm saying? So, uh, just finished leaving his office. And um, somebody told me, somebody wrote just now. I hope you guys can hear me on my on the, on the fucking Bluetooth. Somebody just wrote to me just now, and I looked at it. And they told me to speak a little bit about Blue Boy. But, you see, there's two Blue Boys. There's one Blue Boy that he's Spanish. He's Spanish, me and him was cool. And there's the other blue boy that he's black. Uh, the black blue boy, if you remember back in the days, the youngest kid who was in America's Most Wanted, he was from the Bronx, his name was Baby. Baby was a fucking cold murderer, kid. He was the one that started the jail gang, the Cañoneros. The Cañonero means, uh, what do you mean? Cañonero in English means the, God, how you call it, man? Uh, Cañonero means a man that takes your shit. The, so that's, that's a name for it, but I can't, I can't, I can't think about it right now in English. But that's what Cañonero means. A man that, that both guards you for your shit. He robs you for your shit, and that's it. That's a cañonero. Um, I don't think they last long, because I believe it was the Latin Kings that took them out. You know what I'm saying? I, I believe Latin Kings had two wars with them. One jail, I forgot, the, I, I, I know one jail, and the other jail where they had it at, I forgot. But I don't want to speak about, about that, because, you know, that kid baby, being honest to you, used to work for my man, Mick 2000. And my man, Mick 2000, didn't bail this kid out when he got locked up. His bail was only five fucking hundred dollars, bro. And you had a fucking, you had a 14 year old kid that already on the DL, the nigga already had like 15, 10 bodies. This fucking 14, 15 year old kid had like 15, 10 bodies. And then my motherfucking man didn't bail him out on the 500 dollar bail. So this motherfucker became a terror. This motherfucker came and robbed my man, Mick 2000's brother, Willie. God rest his soul, Bobby. You know, robbed Willie. He lucky that that he liked the Willie, cause he said, yo, I like you, Willie. If I'm not like you, I would've shot you right now. Boom. And believe me, this kid blew up. My man, Crazy Eddie, he blew him up, cause Crazy Eddie became a chingling, and just blew up my man, son. So, you know, that was my man. Eddie was my man, you feel me? And uh, he blew up some other guys. Put you like this. My old crew had beef with this nigga. And this nigga had beef all over the fucking Bronx, B. I'm telling you, this nigga was in America's Most Wanted. This motherfucker killed at least, at least 19 motherfuckers, B. I say about 25. Fuck around. Now, I heard that him and Blue Boy, Black Blue Boy, when added, one on one, gun to gun, the both was getting stick, they both was going at it with each other. Hold up, man. 